Hey, get back here. So, new content launched in MLB The Show 19. You'll see my left field. Uh, I decided to just put in a bid for him, and I got him pretty quickly. So, Eno Slaughter is one of the new cards. We are going to go and take a look at the new cards, take a look at the new contents, and maybe pull a couple packs. So, we got McCann here, who would have been a god last year. This year, though, uh, without the arm strength, that catcher, and the speed, it hurts him a little bit. Uh, but great vision, great contact, so you cannot knock this car because he will knock you like he knocks balls. Uh, so overall, very solid catcher. Uh, we'll take a look what he's going for the market. The other one is Eno Slaughter. Great contact, great vision, perfect for the meta. The only issue is the lack of contact. So that kind of holds, sorry, lack of speed. Um, so that definitely holds him back. Arm strength at 82 isn't the greatest, but he's not like he's lofting out there. But there are guys that compete with this spot. The Gwyn, who I have. But you can throw him in left field. But then you got Henderson out there. Um, center fielders is a few choices. If, you, if you've if you done the whole collection, you got Mays. Um, and, and then, like like I said, Lofton or Henderson go one of the left field centers, center field spots for you. Um, so Enos is kind of like almost there as like the perfect meta car, but just loses some speed there. So I'll be testing him out as you see my lineup. Um, I don't know if I'll be putting a gameplay on the channel because it seems like people don't like the gameplay. We'll pull those packs in a minute when we get back because currently the Enos is going for 57.51 and the McCann is going for 93.86. We are also able to get, um, oh, ooh, 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 let's do series future stars. We got a new future stars. Uh, Riley here is the big name because uh, he's doing nothing but smacking dingers. So great power. Like I said, this is a great meta card last year, uh, but we are not last year. So low speed, good arm strength though from third base, um, and contact and vision's a little bit lower than you like to see too. So not in all star, he's good. All star difficulty. If you get if you play an all star, if you're in like lower in rank seasons, uh, BR that kind of stuff, maybe you play casual online, uh, an all star difficulty. Great card for that. Great, great, great card. But um, not the most wonderful one. So we also got Keston. Some uh, nice contact, okay vision, uh, 59 speed is, is fine for second baseman, uh, solid addition right there. And I think Rogers is also, wait, is Rogers new? Shoot, let me check, is Rogers new today? Um, yes, Rogers was added to the game today too. So he can play second, third base, or short. 67 speed, solid. So uh, kind of like a drag of all trades there, a little bit less power against lefties than you like, and, and vision's lower than you like, but... Not a bad. If you're if you're fan fan of Rogers, go ahead and get them. Whether it's Aaron or Brendan, they're fine Rogers to me. So future stars are new. Also, their live series cards came out. Riley's a 73, Keston's a 73, and Brendan Brendan is a 74. All right. So in addition to those cards, we were able to get the event, the Speedster event. Um, event. You see you see the rules over there. Common silver and common players play with 85 plus speed, max overall, minimum overall, and max team overall three innings. So not that bad. The flashback D Gornet isn't half bad itself. Um, and I'm getting a phone call, but I'll minimize it. Uh, so what do you want? Right? Speedy dudes. Nine speed. Wait, what? Why are they active for the account? Wait, I thought it was. Silver and common players or players with 85 silver. Oh, so silver players. That's why. I was like, wow. We, I didn't know Miguel Cabrera was fast. So, yeah, speed or silver. But the max over, team overall is like 75. So, you're going to. I don't know how many speedsters are going to be. Karu. I guess there's a couple. Outfield's got some speed here if you want to go Ricky. But your max, max overall is 87. So, you can't use like the top end cards. A little frustrating there. Uh, this event won't be that different than other events because it's not exactly speed. You're not going to see a whole lot of speed. Um, I guess no bronze cards, huh? Oh, that's kind of interesting. I wonder if they should have done just like just 85 plus speed, but maybe there's some complaints about last year's event. I don't know. Uh, so we also got we also got moments here, warm-up moments. Do you like that event? That event's fine to me. We got new third inning moments to help you progress there for this day in history. Um, we got a few of those. So that's neat. Helping us on the third inning for those who haven't already grinded through it. I'm not one of them who's grinded through it. And then we have, um, no, 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 that's not. Where are the, I actually don't know. There it is. Warm up moments. Yeah. 
um, silver and speed warm up. So you get a nice little 78 Molitor. Not bad. Just do some of these moments. Um, I think I like the third inning moments better because that's the kind of things that I need to grind. I need 100 more um, basically stars for that. So anyways, that's a lot of the content. Uh, we also have a new... Is it on the front page? We have a new schedule that they put into the game coming soon. So the new event today, third inning content. Our new ranked season starts the 28th. Sporer roster update on the 31st and then flashbacks on the on june 7th so make sure and have plenty of stubs ready for the flashbacks because if it if we get a flashback kind of like uh um bellinger again somebody high in demand those things do go up in price so just wait for that uh but that's kind of the content it's a good content drop i like it i, I think mlb is doing a great job with their content drop the, the cards that they put in the game are interesting mccann um uh, some of the young car the, the future stars and then eno slaughter uh, big fan of uh, Enos and those old St. Louis Cardinals. Was it the Gas House Gang that he was on? Uh, but he is a Cardinal, so you got to knock him a few points for that. That's it for the video, though. Are you guys loving the new content? I hope so. Thanks for watching Call to Action. I'll see you tomorrow.